Hi there, I'm David Newer, I'm the Project Director for Anthology Hoxton Press. We are constructing two towers. Uh, you can see those just over my shoulder here. We've got the taller of the two, which is mono tower, that's 20 storeys. And then the shorter one is 16 storeys uh, duo tower. These two towers were designed by Kara Kushevich Carson Architects and David Chipperfield Architects. Uh, they did the whole of the external facade and then Karakusevich Carton Architects designed the internal show apartment uh, which we'll go and have a look at. Premium. This two bedroom home replicates exactly the floor plan of a home in one of our towers across the road. As soon as we come out of the hallway we're into the kitchen space. So this kitchen has been designed to be as uh, clean lined as possible. You'll note the abundance of natural light in here, which is a function of the floor to ceiling height glazing. So that natural light floods into this space and makes it a real uh, hub of the home. You'll also note the wraparound balcony out there, which gives a huge extra external space. This is a two bed apartment. So as you look down the hallway here, that follows straight down into the bedroom two in this apartment. This master bedroom has an ensuite bathroom and that bathroom has a uh, bath and a fixed overhead shower as well to give it real functionality. The bedroom space itself, that abundance of natural light follows through into here with the large format glazing on the windows. And all of our apartments, the bedrooms come with built-in wardrobes which give that storage space. We'll just take a quick look into the family shower room. The tile here is designed to uh, bring in the design of the brickwork on the external facade. So the stack bonded nature of this tile in a small format replicates that of the brickwork on the outside of the two towers of Mono and Joy. At Anthology, as well as delighting in our customer care, we also look to integrate ourselves into the local community. So standing out here in Shoreditch Park, you can see behind me our construction activities. In the foreground, we've got these three trees. So these trees were going to be destroyed as part of a demolition of phase three. Rather than let that happen, we work with CETRA, which is the Colbert Estate Residence Tenants Association, to rehome those trees in this park. So as well as working with CETRA, it was Shoreditch Park and London Borough of Hackney, we made that possible. Further afield behind my shoulder, you'll see the show apartment that we built. And that apartment has been built on the edge of Shoreditch Park Primary School. So again, we worked in conjunction with the local borough, with Cetra and with the school to ensure that building would have a legacy after our use. So when it's finished with its current use, it can be turned into an education facility that will provide the school children with much needed space to further their education. So lastly, here we are outside to look at the progress that Waits, our construction partner, have made. Waits started back end of September last year. And since then, they've dug a basement, they've put the piles in which form the uh, structural support for the buildings to be built off. They've also built the basements and they're now rising up out of the ground with the floor slabs where the apartments will be built. Behind me here you can see Duo Tower. So Duo Tower is now at level two and they'll carry on pouring those uh, floor slabs at the rate of about one every two weeks. Hope this update has proved useful to you and we look forward to updating you again soon. In the meantime, if there's any more questions, then please contact us with the details provided, or have a look on our website, www.anthology.london, where there'll be more information about Hoxton Press and the progress we're making. So that's all for now, thanks very much.